Alert U.S. Marine patrolling U.S. border has a terrifying warning for Americans after what he found. To all of you out there who think those of us who supported, and voted for, then-candidate Donald Trump because we are xenophobic and racist, here is your wake-up call. A former United States Marine patrolling the Mexico-Texas border has a chilling message for you and all Americans. In an interview with Dennis Michael Lynch, a former U.S. Marine who served in the Middle East is now an active member of a border group that patrols the southern border. He is a former bomb expert trained by the Department of Defense. Known to his pals as Talon, he shared his thoughts about the other than Mexicans that have been coming through the border for years. The Chinese and Middle Eastern people coming through the border are not coming here to cut our lawns and wash dishes. They hate us with a passion, said Talon. When referring to the Muslims who hate the U.S. he said, we are the infidels and they think we deserve to die. DML asked him how long until another 9-11? Talon answered, I'm shocked it hasn't happened yet. Let me tell you that once they figure out how to get a nuke through the border, we will lose a U.S. city. All this isn't news to those of us already living in border states. We see what's coming in on a daily basis. Our cities are being overrun by gang crime like never before. The best of the best doesn't just walk across our borders. These aren't children with divinity in their eyes as Nancy Pelosi calls them. Since President Trump's inauguration, there has been a sharp decrease in illegals crossing the border illegally but we won't be secure until the wall is built and we are able to stop them completely. Last week Attorney General Jeff Sessions sent official letters to the nine different cities, counties and the whole state of California ordering them to stop the madness and let the Department of Homeland Security and ICE do their job. If not they will be punished by ceasing to send these nine entities federal funds. I know my home state of California can't survive long on its own although liberals and loony politicians actually believe it can. Maybe legalizing marijuana in this state wasn't such a great idea after all. To all you liberals out there, please, stop with the finger pointing and accusations. This isn't about being bigoted, Islamophobic, xenophobic, or whatever phobic you want to invent next. It's about our very survival of as a nation as a culture and as a people. If you need to, pretend the bad people slipping in through the border are Christians and Jews. I'm sure if they were you would have no issue whatsoever in building a wall to stop them, but please to play with our security and very existence only because you believe in the madness that is political correctness, correctness.